okay, so <laughs> I couldn't figure out the passcode. Uh, it was uh, the uh, off screen. I was spending so much time trying to mess with different several numbers. Uh, I didn't realize the code was right in the mirror the whole time. So I ended up re removing uh seven minutes of me messing around trying to figure it out, and I didn't even realize the pa the code to the keypad was on you know on the side of the wall next to the mirror. So this is how Max is going gets to kill me. Honey, I always yeah, it's thought okay if I'm gone. I guess my husband I've and new baby will have to Time go without me. Yours. Who Who are you? Holy shit, are you serial? I'm you, dumbass. Or I'm one of many Maxes you've left behind. Can you get me out of here? Oh, so you want help? <laughs> Thought you could control no, that's everybody. A duplicate version huh? of Max. This Twist is time I don't know. <laughs> it wasn't my choice. We didn't ask for this it power. It wasn't my choice. I didn't ask to rewind time. <laughs> Stop playing innocent. You've left a trail of death behind you. You even let that stalker Madsen kill Jefferson. That's sick. You're way more of a cold-blooded killer than him or Nathan. Hey, we're, we're, we're not the ones who, you know, kidnap children, you know, and take inappropriate photos of them. Like a rapist psychopath or something like that. No, I'm a survivor. We I did what we could. I don't experience in time travel or stopping psychopaths like Jefferson. I did what I had to. Oh, the jury will love to hear about your mad time travel skills. I know what I am. You're just trying to hurt me. You're a goddamn hypocrite. Just look at the pain you've caused. That was not my fault, you son of a bitch. Don't you dare talk about our mom that way. <laughs> what about the crap that was your fault? Wait, wait, let me guess. You fucked up time and space for your precious punk Chloe? <laughs> you think she's worth all that? She's our best friend. <laughs> of course. Of course. She's my best friend. Oh yeah, you ignored your best friend for five years while she went through hell. Some friend. Chloe does a better job of guilt tripping me than you do. This because other Max, other bullet. version of Max or something like it's that is really taking home. shots at Max Caulfield. But you didn't do like... that homework. So you have to learn the hard way. Like Rachel. Just shut up. Just like the text messages scared. and everyone else that I'd we were more worried about Chloe hiding from us than Jefferson. Max, do you really think she's our friend? That she respects us in any way? Man, you are so stupid. <laughs> I'm embarrassed to have the same name. And someday Chloe will destroy. Oh hell, speak of the devil. There she is. Dude, do not even fuck with her head. She knows what we went through together this week, and you don't. There's no way you can break up our team. This is reality. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. I am seriously glad to see you. Welcome home, Max. Fasten your seatbelt. Where are we now? This is this. I don't know. We went from being in a nightmare to this. Now these must be memories. Fasten your seatbelt. Memories from the past uh, with Chloe. This song fucking rules. Can't all the fun times they had, all the good moments. A stroll down memory lane. You were here today, Max. You saved me. I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like. Destiny. If this is destiny, I hope we can find Rachel. <clears throat> Mr. Max. What the hell is this? Snowflakes? Or a storm is coming? Max, start from the beginning. Tell me everything. Let's talk about your superpower. Epic! I pledge allegiance to Max and the power for which she stands. You can rewind time, Max. That's fucking insane. We have to play. There's probably going to be a lot of memories as we go and continue this path. Okay, girl wonder. 
full of like cutscenes and stuff between uh, Max and uh, Chloe. Welcome to American Rust, my home away from hell. Raw and rough, it suits you. Max, do you know how awesome this is? I get my best friend back, and she's also super sized. I don't feel so super. Uh, Max, here, um, let me help you find a place to chill. You freaked me out there. Do you feel any better now? You saved me again. Crazy. Now we're totally bonded for life. Since you're the mysterious superhero, I'll be your faithful chauffeur and companion. My powers might not last, Chloe. I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. As long as you're my partner in time. This is when we got in, when we broke into Mr. Uh, Principal Blackwell's office to get those files. They got so many memories. I, they definitely are going to show everything that they did together. Max, you better come check out these files. It's not a drawing. Look. Rachel in the dark room. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. No, you are not taking the cozy chair. Max, do your powers include mind reading? Or did you just rewind because I tried to steal the chair? Shit, I'm confused. It's the powers of best friendship. I know how you roll. Cowabunga! My luck, an otter in my water. When we broke into the school, the we got into the pool. Effects. Especially you. I can already tell. You're not so chicken shit anymore. Thanks, girlfriend. And you make me feel like I have a reason for still being in Arcadia Bay. Let's call it a draw. I'm gonna freeze my ass off when I get out. You look cute with your hair soaked in chemicals. Hide! Hide! You can't go back to your dorm now. You're a Blackwell fugitive. Crash at my place tonight. Photo bomb! Photo hog. It feels like a different world from yesterday. We left a skid mark on Blackwell last night. I wish we could just hang out all morning like we used to. Maybe we should get up. I have to get back to Blackwell soon. I double dare you. Kiss me now. Sorry, not that easy. Oh, like I am? Just admit that you already macked on me, then used your rewind. Now I can text Warren that you're saving yourself all for him. You're such a dork. everywhere in this bad boy can you see us heading down the coast of big sur and beyond yeah this is it, i don't know how many it is but you know it's way back from all the the memories between max and chloe from all the previous episodes all they did all the moments rachel straight up lied to my face why didn't she say anything because she knew how you were leading her all the way up to the the lighthouse as we get closer just another person who shits all over me why does everybody in my life let me down? My dad gets killed, you bail on me for years. My mother gloms on a step fucker. Now Rachel betrays me. Not until I see it first. You know the rules, Dad. Dude, I am so lucky that my father is cool. Max, you are being so fucking strange. You feel okay? Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome. <laughs> It's weird hanging out with you again. I know. I'm glad we are, though. Look, the worst thing you can do is treat me like a baby. I still want to laugh and talk shit with my best friend. Can we stop? This is seriously the best view of the sunset. What do photographers call that? The golden hour. Picture. We look so badass in our pirate gear. 
we should have taken over Arcadia. Now this was back when we uh, had the Ashina kill uh, Chloe and end her life, you know, end her suffering. My but for my playthrough, I chose not to. And, uh, and it's only getting worse. I've heard the doctors talking about it when they thought I was zonked out. So I know I'm just putting off the inevitable while my parents suffer along. And I will too. This isn't how I want things to end. What? What are you saying? I'm saying that being with you again has been so special. I just wanted to feel like when we were kids running around Arcadia Bay and everything was possible and you made me feel that way today. I want this time with you to be my last memory. Do you understand? Chloe, you're back. I'm just, I'm just, I'm so glad you're here. You sound high, but thanks for the morning grope. Since we were up all night playing CSI Arcadia Bay, I was still spaced out here trying to put all this info together. Kate wasn't the first. All those binders are filled with other victims. <sighs> Victoria has to be next. Nathan must be planning to dose her tonight at the Vortex Club party. Rachel. And I'll be honest, back when this, when we went to, when we found out all these files on Kate, Rachel, Amber, and all them, I really thought Nathan was the culprit, but, you know, all changed when we found out, you know, Jefferson was, you know, behind it all along. no way she's dead. No way. She posed for those pictures, Max. I know it. Please, let's go. I still didn't like Nathan, but, you know, that completely changed my, you know, my assumptions about him. <clears throat> Okay. 